The Tornado GR4 has been in service with the RAF since the 80s and it's been deployed all over the world. But they're getting to the end of their lifespan and spend a lot of time in hangars like this getting maintained. Repairing the aircraft in small spaces can however cause damage to different parts of the Tornado, which is why BAE systems have come up with a solution. When we're doing any maintenance within this area, deep in, deep in the air, within the aircraft here, uh, there's a, a PTO shaft, a power takeoff shaft, uh, which is quite easily damaged. So to avert that damage, we've uh, created these guards, uh, which will stop any further damage being caused. But these protective guards aren't made in the traditional way you might expect. They are printed using a 3D printer. Well, this uh, dark component on the screen here is an item from the aircraft which links the gearbox to the engine. Um, in service, historically, there's been a big problem with it in that it becomes damaged when they're taking it in and out of the aircraft. Um, so using our 3D scanning machine, we scanned uh, the shaft and decided that the best way to avoid the damage would be to uh, produce some covers that uh, fit to the end of the shaft so when they are taken in and out of the aircraft, uh, it, that reduces the damage. It might look like a coffee vending machine, but this £28,000 3D printer is the future. It works by using lasers to fuse tiny particles of hot plastic into layers to make complex shapes. So from the virtual model on the computer, information is transmitted to this 3D printer. And within only one day, computer-aided design is turned into physical reality. So far, around half a dozen protective guards have been created, as well as repair plates. These are used as templates for metal. It means that a quick prototype can be made to prove the design before committing to the expense of a metal one. Uh, our brief being here is to ensure that when damage is found or there are problems found in maintaining the jets, we're here to help very quickly resolve those problems and provide solutions that don't otherwise exist in the, the maintenance manual. From the 3D printer to the aircraft, this guard is now ready to do its job and protect this power takeoff shaft. And if it can do this in 2014, then the possibilities for 3D printing are endless. Laura Hawkins, Forces News, RAF Marham.